All right, guys, we've got a really long and sweaty one for you today. Make sure you got about an hour to do this thing. It's gonna be long. Here we go, let's talk about it. It's gonna start off with 100 double unders, and then you're gonna cycle through 21 power clean, 21 over the bar burpees, then 15 and 15, nine and nine. Once you're done with that couplet, you're gonna run 800 meters as your buy-in for the next couplet. Then it's 21 push jerk, 21 jumping squats, 15 and 15, nine and nine, and then you're gonna do 100 double unders, which is your buy-in for the final couplet, which is 21, 15, nine of front squats and mountain climbers. Once you're done with that couplet, you don't gotta run, you don't have to do double unders, you're done with the workout. All right, here we go, let's talk about our movements here. Double unders, if you don't got a rope, then we can just go with the lateral hop. If you got a rope, you can do a single under or a double under. When you're doing this, stay lofty and relax your quadriceps when you're airborne. Jump about four to six inches off of the ground as you're doing those, okay? Uh, for the power clean, from here, if you don't have a barbell, just stretch to your end range through your hamstrings, and then from here, think slow to the knee, jump, catch. That's what a power clean is, and you're gonna catch them on the shoulders with your elbows out in front of your objects. All right, the, uh, over the bar burpee or over an object burpee, you do this laterally. Thighs, stomach, and chest all get down on the ground and then you're gonna jump and clap over your object, okay? Um, or I'm sorry, jump over your object. You don't need to clap, just get over your object, whatever that may be. If you can't do a burpee, then just do an up down. So you're just gonna keep those arms straight and then again, you can step over or jump over your object, your choice. All right, your run, pick out a run that's gonna be fun and exciting for you, let it rip. Your push jerk. So it's the same movement power pattern as a power clean, but we're gonna send the object from shoulder to overhead. So we're still landing with our knees bent here, and we're jumping the objects off of our shoulders, receiving them on a straight elbow. That's the definition of a jerk. On the jumping squat. So it's a squat, but we're gonna go airborne with each repetition. So we're generating some power here on top of the rep. Make sure that your feet go back down in your squat stance so you can go right into that next rep. All right, we already talked about the double under, so let's go to the front squat. Grab your object, keep it at your front rack. If you got an odd object, hold it in the goblet position or shoulder it, and then from here we're gonna squat. Hips back, heels down, knees out. Okay, it's that simple. Go to your end range, whatever is in your fitness. And then the mountain climber. From here, we're gonna float that front toe. Use your abdominals to pull the knee into the chest. Don't just throw your legs around. Make your abs work here. All right, guys, it's a fun one. Have fun. Keep it up. You're doing great.